What's going on, my fellow freedom lovers? Matty Ice here, and welcome to another episode of Freedom Research and Reviews, where I show you exactly what I'm doing in my life to both achieve and protect my freedom. And in this video, I'm going to be sharing with you uh, something really cool that I just got in the mail. It's from uh, it's a body armor set from AR500. I'll have a link down in the description. You can check it out. Um, they have some really good stuff. Uh, it's really cool. Uh, but I'm basically going to show you uh, everything that was included, what it came with and uh, then show you what it's like uh, after assembly and how to actually assemble it and everything like that. All right, so let's get into it. All right, guys, so let's go through what was included in my AR500 body armor kit. I purchased the Testito 3 bundle, I, uh, I believe it was. All right, so obviously we have our, our vest, and um, I'm gonna do some uh, basic assembly, show you how to insert the plates and put on the accessories and everything, but definitely check out the links in the description. Uh, there's a little bit more I don't know, I guess more details on uh, how to get this uh, properly installed and fitted, you know, because that's uh, that's really important. But I'm gonna show you how to, just the, kind of the basics of the vest. And then we have two trauma pads, which uh, separates you from the armor and the, or goes in between the arm, you and the armor, and just kind of helps uh, reduce some of the recoil. And I guess uh, it's just additional protection. Uh, and then we have the actual plates themselves, actually pretty heavy, so it's gonna be interesting to see how uh, heavy the, the vest actually is, because again, this is my uh, my first body armor kit. And of course, we have our Glock 17 right here, just for showmanship, of course, that was not included. All right, uh, let's see what else. Uh, we have some cool accessories here. So we have the, uh, the handgun or pistol magazine pouch. They have some that are double pouches where you can actually put two magazines in each pouch here, I don't think that's what came with this one because when I open this up, I seriously doubt I'm gonna be able to get more than one in there. All right, um, but either way, uh, still cool to uh, good to start out with. Um, you have your you know your AR-15 magazine pouches or your really it's your your 30 rounds uh, magazine whatever you're using, and then it also has uh, some little uh, shotgun shells uh, holders that, uh, that you can do right here. You got two right here and then two on this one, so that's pretty cool. Also came with a pistol holster that uh, goes on the uh, the, the top right here, top center. All right. And then also came with a battle belt for additional accessories. And then I purchased this separately. This is a uh, shotgun pouch, shotgun shell pouch. Uh, some of their promotions come with this. So again, check out the link in the description, see what kind of promotions they're running. Uh, Cause they usually have some really good deals, but you could put four shells right here in the front and then obviously open this up, put an entire box in here if you want. Of course you can also do, you know, doesn't have to be uh, shotgun shells, could be medical supplies or whatever. The, whatever it is that you want. And then um, uh, you can see right here, this is where we attach it. You can either do, uh, later on we'll show you how to do on the on the vest. Um, you could also do this on the battle belt, whatever. And then obviously it comes with the, I don't even know what these are called, uh, the bands or whatever. This is what you use to actually attach your these accessories to the vest. All right, so uh, pretty cool. I mean, they, they kind of give you everything that you need to, to, to get started with one of these, so it's pretty cool. So uh, let's get into how to actually assemble this now. All right, guys, let's break down how the vest actually works. All right, <clears throat> so what we want to do is, the, the first thing is to take off, or, or like undo this, the, the, the center part here. So we're gonna take that off, all right? And then this is where you undo the side so that you can actually put the thing on. Otherwise, it's kind of hard to put on. And then uh, obviously you undo the, the belt buckles here, all right, and you can adjust these uh, for, for comfort and you know, making, them, making it fit better or whatnot. So you undo your buckles and it opens up like this. And this is how you would actually put it on. Like, I mean, I've got it on backwards, but that, that's how you would do it. And then, this is kind of a poor demo. And then you would, you would do your belt buckle, bring this in, wrap it around, pull the center piece back over. And of course I have it on backwards, but that's essentially how it would work, okay? Uh, but really, I just wanna show you how to put the, the, the plates in. All right, so we have this open, okay? All right, so what we're gonna do is up down here at the bottom, we've got more Velcro, we're just gonna open this up. All right, there's a couple things, we're gonna undo this flap right here, all right, that comes out, and then there's two little straps that are Velcroed in as well that we wanna take out. All right, and just bring those out like this, okay? So that's what you should have. And then we're going to take our armor and we're gonna put it in like this, so the, the kind of, it's kind of slanted in, and then the the shorter piece here, where it's it's kind of cut off uh, right there, we're just gonna insert it like this, all right? And again, guys, I'm gonna have another link in the description from, uh, it's a video from AR500 showing you how to 
to do this, but uh, just a couple, what, whatever, a couple little things that I, I learned uh, along the way. Uh, so we're gonna insert our trauma pad, same thing. We're just gonna put that right on top. All right, and then from there, we're gonna put our straps back in. All right, all the way in, nice and nice and snug, nice and tight. And then we're gonna put the, the actual flat back in here. Okay, make sure it's right up against the armor. Then we're gonna push down, and boom, that's it. And then you literally just do the same thing on the opposite side here. Now this one, because this is the front part, this one, uh, let's see if you can see it. There's a, uh, there's an extra like little strap in here. It doesn't, it's not Velcro. It's just kind of part of the vest. You want it to, you want the the armor to go underneath this part right here, okay? On this one. So we're gonna lift this up and slide it in between there. All right, same thing with the trauma pad. Okay, here we go. Put the buckles in, or straps, whatever. All right, do the flap. That's it, all right. Now let me uh, let me actually put it on properly this time. So, it should go on like this. Uh, okay. All right, now we're actually, we'll do our, our buckles here. We'll do that first. See, mine's a little loose. I still need to tighten them. All right. We have our buckles. And then from here, we're going to lift the center piece back up. And we're going to put our side pieces back in, right? And again, you want this to be pretty pretty snug. You want this to fit really well. You don't want, to, you don't want it moving around a lot. You want it to fit you really good. When you, uh, so the way I learned it is if you take a deep breath, it should feel pretty tight against your, against your chest. Not to where obviously you can't breathe, but, so that's a, that's pretty snug. All right, and then this comes back down. Probably put this a little bit lower here. There we go. And boom, you're good to go. And that's, uh, that's on pretty good. All right, so that's how you put your, your plate carriers in and how you actually put the vest on. It took me a minute to find a video on how to actually do this properly. Because like I said, this is my uh, my very first armor vest, whatever. Um, so next, uh, let me show you how to put the accessories on and that'll be it. All right guys, so now we're gonna do the, uh, attach the accessories. I'm just gonna show you how to put on one of the pouches here really quick. Cause once you know how to do one of them, you can you pretty much know how to do the rest. All right, this is where our bands are gonna come in handy. Um, these four are for the, the front part, so when you're putting your two, uh, your magazine pouches on the on the front of the vest, like right here, okay? Uh, this is where you're gonna need the, the longer black ones, all right? So, all right, let's, uh, let me show you how to set, how to, how to do this. It's pretty easy. It just, it took me a while to figure this out. Uh, it was kind of a pain finding a video on it. Um, I'll link uh, in the description to some other things on accessories and whatnot, so make sure you check it out. But uh, all right, all we're going to do is take one of our pouches here, and on the back, we are going to uh, let's see which which way is it? This way, right? Yes. Okay. So we're going to take. So you notice that on the on the bands, there's this little little flap here. This is actually so if you when you connect it like this, because this is how you, you slide it in. If you make a mistake and you want to undo it, you just lift this piece up, pull up, and then it, it comes out, okay? All right, but anyways, we're going to slide it in. I'll, I'll show you what it looks like here in a second. I'm going to do this one on the far right and then one on the far left. Kind of like the political system in our freaking country right now. It's ridiculous. Anyways, we're not, uh, we're not here to rant. All right, so that's what it's going to look like. Okay, now once we have it like this, then we're gonna take the, the ends here and start sliding it through these little Velcro pieces. 
could slide it underneath here. All right, that's what you want to do. All right, so we're going to do, and you just you line them up, and then we're going to go all the way through to the very top, and we're going to start to kind of fold this over as we move it up. All right, and make sure these are all the way in. All right, and once it's all the way up, okay, like that, all right, we're going to flip this over, and we're just going to insert this piece into the top piece right here. Okay, that's uh, literally all you're doing. It's uh, it's actually pretty easy, and you should hear a little click. You can hold the little, uh, hold the bottom of it. I don't know if you heard that, but there was a little click there. It lets you know that it's secured. Do the same thing here, and there it is. All right, and it's on there pretty snug. See, pretty cool. All right. Moves around a, a little bit, but it's it's on there pretty good. All right, and then you just do the same thing for your for your pistol, uh, your your pistol round pouch, whatever it's called. Um, let's see, that's uh that's pretty much it, guys. I, I don't want this video to be too long. I just wanted to show you what comes with this uh, this bundle that I got. I think it's really cool. I think these things are just really important to have. Hopefully, you never have to use them, but I just uh, I like being prepared because uh, you just never know what's going to happen. In a, in a city near you in America these days. So <laughs> I'd much rather be prepared. So uh, if you guys have any questions, leave a comment down below. Again, check out the links in the description. Uh, sometimes, like I said, you go through the link, they have some pretty good promotions and stuff like that. Check out different tutorials on uh, different pieces of body armor and how to set this up or whatnot. All right, make sure you subscribe, like the video if you found it helpful, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Stay free.